Well, this morning, a school assignment is coming to life in Winooski. Students with paintbrush in hand creating self-portraits, and they're all on display. Yeah. NBC 5's Jackie Pascal joins us live right now. So, Jackie, what's so special about this project? Well, David, Alice, Scout features local art all of the time, but for these young artists, it is very special to have their self-portraits up on the wall. Take a look. I'm not just saying this is what I look like, but saying this is who I am. An assignment to create a self-portrait taking on new meaning at Winooski Middle School. It was going to be just a whole bunch of things on paper that I didn't know where to put them. So Ms. Jacobs has them focus on what they like. I really like pastel colors. I love to play soccer. And then narrow down what makes them unique. I drew some mountains for my hometown, Nepal. Show the like... Uh, Muslim girls can do anything like they want. From diverse backgrounds to more vulnerable aspects of their lives. So we're supposed to do some, or some of the hardships I went through, like just figuring out my identity. That's not easy to open yourself up to the public on the walls of a popular coffee shop, especially for a middle schooler. But Logan Irwin says they hope it'll give clarity as to who they really are. People are calling me by she, her pronouns still even though they know I've changed my pronouns and it makes me extremely uncomfortable. Putting their passions and identities out there, the students say actually makes them feel more comfortable. I think it's fun to have my personality and for my community to learn who I am as a person. I feel like it makes me a part of the community and that I belong here. So it makes me really proud that they feel comfortable sharing those parts of themselves. The district says it hopes to continue showcasing its students' work in the future, giving them space to shine. It's a great way for the kids to reflect on who they are that year um, and then in subsequent years reflect on how they've changed. Now, the art teacher also wanted me to mention that all of the materials used to put these on display were all donated by local businesses, so a lot of people coming together to make sure this all looked so great in here. And you can see all of these self fortress for yourself. Uh, they're in Scout all month long uh, here in Winooski, and there's also going to be a special reception in here on November 21st during Winooski's monthly art walk. We're live here this morning, Jackie Pascal, NBC5 News.